Hi, this is Sheila for Readers Entertainment, and today we're going to be looking at the typewriter revolution. Uh, as many of you know, I uh, collect typewriters and I use typewriters. I'm a writer, and this book couldn't have come at a better time. I am a novice collector. The book is fantastic for those of you who are just starting to have an interest. It has a little bit of history, not a lot. Primarily, it's going to take a look at what people have uh, have been doing with typewriters uh, now that we have computers, some really interesting things that they're doing that are fantastic. Like people are taking their typewriters out at the park and they're setting up and they're writing poetry for other people or you know so there's a lot of really interesting things that people are doing with typewriters. If you have one and you're wondering what in the world can I do with it, this is definitely a book that you want to have. It also takes a look at just some basic ways that you can take care of your typewriter. Um, you know, it tells you uh, all the things on the typewriter, what it's called, so you you learn all of that. And uh, it's great whether you are just starting out, whether you're just thinking about getting a typewriter, you want to see some of the things you can do, if you just want to be able to take care of your own machine, and if you're more advanced, there's a lot of stuff in there for uh, for you. This is by uh, Richard Polt, who is an expert in this field, and uh, he's also a philosophy professor. So, you know, it's, it's written in a really personable way, really interesting way, so that um, it's, it's not just like a tech guide. There's a lot of really interesting things that he brings up about typewriters and about the past. So I think that you'll really love it. I think that uh, you should give it a try. Again, it's The Typewriter Revolution by Richard Polt. I'll show that to you again. Here you go. And uh, I highly recommend it to anyone with an interest in typewriters.